you could two first one and buy. The second one you two and you won't crave me. You mini and Bakwa would give me side, no, I said, you were flimming. No, I saw a blend here and face you. Yes, you're this one of the cooking moon. And the name not to tell it. That they know. Timmy Tim, you're Jesus, me, Jimmy Free, Jimmy Free, no, me, no, no, be at the TV. At the TV, I'm in the TV, and you're not in the hospital. One of the survivors of the electric shock, 35-year-old Yao Fripong. Fripong and another who survived the incident have been discharged from the hospital. Ceciano, Mr. When you may and you be our TBR, so Mumpire may. May I survive? No one's over with the Yango Pong. And for Monsieur, you may. No one can pay boom. But shock and anger is what residents of Wanchi experienced for the better part of Sunday. Two residents passed away in just a flash. The deceased, identified as Yao Edu 28, Daniel Weroku 26, were electrocuted. Here is wife of late Yao Edu, Sewa Patricia. <laughs> <laughs> Late Yao Edu left behind three children. According to residents, the fatal accident could have been avoided. Abina Asantiwa witnessed the incident. <laughs> We know. Why tension? A year away. Now, Tija, then you find that the crime will be in a good form, say, Tim. I want to see a moon, my mamlo, my mamlo, my mamlo. The hazard here is real, but restaurants' complaints never got attention. I'm a committee member. Yes, but let me tell you the, the electricity people, I don't know what is wrong with them. Because they know we reported the, the reported to them, but I don't know what is going on. A letter to the writer to tension cables. They left it like that. This hang it was hanging, and finally the guys you know almost push here. They know. I mean, nobody ever thought of going up, 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 and then they they, they cannot be touched. Because of the metal, it touched this thing. There was a flash and the, everybody fell off. All efforts to speak to the electricity company of Ghana proved futile. A report by Mahmoud Mohamed Nuruddin.